Hello everyone, uh, my name is Yogesh Sakar. Today I will be unboxing MI's 20,000 milliampere power bank. Now I already have a 10,000 milliampere power bank from uh, MI or Xiaomi, whatever you want to call it. And I also had a power bank from Ambrin. Unfortunately, it stopped working. So I was really in a need for another power bank before another trip. And since this MI has been working without any issue, I decided to go ahead and uh, once again buy a Xiaomi product. And let's unbox this. Let's see how good, bad, ugly it is. I bought this from MI.com. MI is an Indian website and i placed the order yesterday and it arrived today so it was fairly fast this is a 20000 milliampere uh, power bank made by xiaomi in india for india though i guess uh, it is pretty much similar to the international range it is supposed to be better than this one because uh, this one does not have the lithium ion batteries that uh, the newer uh, power banks come with. Anyways, uh, let's see how it is. It is certainly quite a bit larger than the earlier 10,000 milliampere power bank that I had. It is heavier as well, no doubt about that. A little bit thicker, if you can see this properly. It is a little bit thicker, a little less wide, but in height it is uh, quite a bit lot more. So it's not going to be as easily pocketable as this one. However, this newer power bank has two ports so that uh, you can charge two devices simultaneously. This one only had one. So that's a big plus point. Apart from this, let's see if we get anything else. Just a normal USB cable. And uh, if you go over the specification quickly, it does support quick charge. So uh, it supports nine volt at two ampere. I do not have any mobile phone which requires quick charge. So I won't really be using that feature, but at least it is good to have. It also have a lithium polymer battery, which is supposedly better. And uh, it is supposed to be quite good at uh, charging and uh, even at this moment it is showing that it has half charge. There are four LEDs that indicate that charge level. So I'll have to go ahead and charge this up. Hopefully this would be as good as the earlier power bank I had from MI. This has been rock solid. I've been using it for quite a while now and I've been really happy with this. Just that 10,000 milliampere these days uh, is not really that much. It is uh, really insufficient if you're doing a long trip and a 20,000 milliampere one is going to be far better. On top of, on top of that, uh, I really have to you know charge my iPad these days as well as use uh, uh, action camera that that can be also part by a power bank so hopefully all these two would be good enough for just about any trip i plan to undertake apart from treks and i'll be back with a full proper review of it later on for now thank you for watching this video do like and share if you liked it